Hey there everyone, the Sao Cow playing Hyper Sex. Last time I locked my way through a level that everyone seems to agree is super hard. Bet you can't guess what this level name is called. Alright, uh, today we might just be ending world 5. 4 star, mushroom at the start. Everything is gray and dull, there's roof. Check out that sweet timing there. That's arbitrary. Hey, here we go! World 5! This is the fifth world. Did you know your math? Alright, so now you go. But wait, you don't? Oh yeah, you can just... That kind of lava again. Really? Why can't you just use normal lava, hey Mari? Like, just use normal lava that just gives you a bit of lead. This is instant bubble death lava. Oh boy, enjoy. I guess that just means I gotta jump around a little bit. I mean, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna be... So am I still... Uh, Alright, so it's a repeat of this level's pat gimmick. Hopefully it doesn't have the same second exit, where is we... Okay, so that's what those coins mean. <laughs> Coin guides are always accurate, you just don't always know accurate for what. <laughs> So there, I was just dead? Ah, it's gonna work perfectly. Don't worry. <laughs> amount of time. It's pretty good. Uh, it's like... I, I wouldn't, like, ask it to go to the prom or anything, but... I look, I as soon as it starts to dip, like I'm gonna be real close to touching the, the bubble. I need to jump preemptively. I don't have a choice there. They're not really. I jump way too early again. Alright, well we're somewhere. Oh, I'm supposed to I'm supposed to grab a new a new bread there. Obviously. Now it's all gone. Now we're starting anew with a new bread. I think. I sure as hell don't know. Oh, okay. That's new. Instead of dunking in the lava, it dunks in the soda. On top of the screen is what I meant. Like, obviously. So, did I lose? Well, there's a new bread there, so I guess that's just what I'm gonna be grabbing. You can't do this if you're small! But this is fine, like this, uh... That's my fault, death, where I did a bad jump off of the chain, because those are always awkward. It's kind of easy to forget that when the rest of the level is beyond awkwardness, but you know. Wow, that happened. <laughs> Oh, there's a roof there! But Stupid Smebex lava is so dumb. So does it just disappear? I uh, doesn't matter. Not really. So last time I died because I jumped too early from the chain. Because I wanted to go quick, because here you do have to act real quick. Yeah, you gotta go there, then you gotta handle that. And it's just like, alright, what am I... Why are you doing... Don't... Don't... Alright, go down here, I guess. <laughs> just a big... Ah! I dipped! Why'd you dip? Don't dip! Like, you can tell this level is made strictly with the purpose of trapping you, because as soon as I know how to defuse a situation, getting past it becomes very easy. Like, it's... Uh, Ah, shoot. Okay, well, I made it. It's a level that requires entirely on... The equivalent- it's- it's the level equivalent of shock value, if that makes sense. See there, you just need to know you need to zoom on to the end. You have no way of really knowing that. It's- it's a jump scare. It's platforming jump scare. It's so lame. This is such a lame, stupid, dumb level. Oh, tries to trick you, tries to scare you. Here we do yet another dive flop into. Here, there's a little something. Here, you need to hurry to each one. You don't know you need to hurry. You need to hurry to each one. There's a skeleton. 
really, I th there's, there's a weird roof thing going on with this level that I really don't care for. Oh my god, I'm gonna save so much time! PR! Here we go! PB, whatever. <laughs> Personal rest. <laughs> Whoa, this is a flip a zoo. Never seen that before in video games. Whoa, the thwomp just thwomp. Never seen that before in a video game. Whoa, the platform moves. Never seen that before in a video game. Whoa. A skeleton. Never seen that before in a video game. Is that a chain I can go on? Or I need to go on a candle? The chain is a darker gray, so I'm thinking it's not one I can go on. And it's kind of like, kind of a mini trap. Yeah, you gotta do some one tile platforming. Yo. Alright, so how are you gonna trap me this time? I didn't even jump. <laughs> I was like, nah. I'm good. <laughs> Hey, midpoint. So, this was a very bad level. Let me tell you why. The level is... Oh, what? That's a tricky one. The level is entirely built around the idea that it's gonna trick you. It's a series of small traps. The problem is, the level's kinda long. And the level doesn't really have anything going on for itself. So, you just kinda... Uh, is there anything here? I'm just kind of... Oh! oh, 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 oh. Alright. Uh, yeah, so yeah, like, level's just, is just bad. Because, like, you get caught by, by the trap. You solve it. You know how to defuse the trap. You still have to go through all the motions every single time you meet your demise. Which, I mean, is fine. It's just that... Hang on, I'm gone. Look, it happens. It's just that... Once the traps are diffused, the level is incredibly boring, cause man, there's just nothing going on. And uh, that's why platforming jump scares is not something I would recommend if you're thinking about making your own level. Oh look, I'll might die a few times to this. It always takes me a bit to get a rhythm of fireball, because they're small and they go pretty fast. It's normal, don't worry. I'll meet you on the broadside. It's new. It's a new idiot. I'm trying to fight the spread. There we go. It's all about minimizing your movements. Well, I was playing in a way that maximized my movements constantly. So hey, and da da da. I flew. Oh, that's a speedy speed boy right there. Oh, you know what? Let's duck. Yo. All right. So you go here. You go here. You mess it up, you end up here. Got it. Eh. I did it. I saw... <laughs> Seeing the universe sink there was... kind of funny. I, like, I know how this is done. This is done through, uh... auto-scrolling. It's using... the auto-scroll function. Wait, you're changing the rules where now coins don't matter, but it's the lamp? Like, come on, man. Like, there was two ways to understand that. Either that, you know, you still need to follow the coins and that they do a little staircase. Or that suddenly you need to interpret it as an arrow. And so you only go where it goes down. But, like, there's no reason to assume that... It's just gonna change to no, know suddenly it's an arrow. Like, that's a completely ludicrous thing to think. But, it's what Haimari expects. Like, can you do, right? It's 
rules of the game are malleable. So let's go straight in the middle. So here's it going to be straight in the middle of this lamp? Yes. All right. <laughs> this is kind of funny, though. Uh... Hey. Great. Ah, fantastic. To the moon. So what does that mean there, though? Is it the yellow coin or is it the blue coin? The yellow coin stopped to be platform. So does that mean I need to go with the blue coins? Or are yellow coins back into business? I have no idea. I do not know, my friend. No one knows. Goes down. I mean, these all could be pipes. They are all pipes in the end. Alright, here are the rule changes. Now skeletons. Now... Oh, I'm still around. So it is blues. Alright. I don't know how I managed to jump over that block that way. I am just as confused as you are. So, uh... Nice. Alright, let's... <laughs> I didn't mean to just kind of take off here, but ultimately, it didn't really help me out. But hey, confirm... Oh wow, I'm gonna have to bounce on a blue bullet. Oh man. <laughs> yeah... It's looking that way. Unless there's invisible blocks, which is... Basically on the same overall quality threshold of not, really. <laughs> yeah, I, look. I'm starting to rush. Uh, let's wait a little bit. Show a little bit of patience. Sometimes. Goodbye. Although, thinking about it. Wow, that was... Sad. Either oh, sad. This is supposed to be sad. Oh, am I alive? If this is sad. All right. So, hey. Yeah, I'm not. <laughs> yeah, I'm not registering any hidden blocks or anything. It's the level isn't even over. Welcome to. Just kind of casually walk off the ledge party. Look. Haimari knows what he's doing. He gave me a cape knowingly. I'm gonna use that cape willingly. Like... Okay, there's something going on with those platforms. Okay, so it's just dice. Alright, that's fair. So that's what happens when you're on ice and you don't know. Everything, you just kind of swing off. Oh boy, okay. Uh, 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 uh. None of this feels good! Holy moly. Alright, let's just calm down here. Calm, calm. Calm down. Calm down. Calm. Calm down. Please. Missile Bill. No one cares about you. Giant flagpole. It's not even a flagpole. Oh. Since when does ice feel so bad? Alright. Uh. Go into Rotunda. Become one with the wind. Bullets literally coming out of. Nothing, and I don't know how you get in this door without getting hurt. <sighs> You've got to be pooping on my face. Really? Really? I guess so. Those weird whistling sounds. 
Yeah, this is weirdly hard to do because they're going at the same speed I'm going when I'm holding the jump button with a cape. This would be easier without a cape. Eh. Alright, oh yeah, I need to wait for this guy. Actually, I don't. You know what, Bullet? I hate you. And your saxophone. Sorry you had to learn about this this way. Here's his bullets. How does this work? Can I despawn them? Can I kill them with a shell? That'd be funny. Cause like, if I could get in there with my cape, I could just swap the bullets away. And we wouldn't be having any conversation. Are you expected to just kind of end up in between? Because I don't even know if you can enter it from in between is a thing. Alright, they're dead. What am I doing? Oh, Cal, don't make this harder than you need to. Just wait. Be patient. The Potabos are placed in, like, the least dangerous areas in the universe. Take your time. You know what? It's cool to take your time. You know what cool kids do? They take their time. That's why they're cool. They never get anything done. Bam! Finger guns. <laughs> what a weird level. Uh, it's a level about traps. Both three... I mean, it's weird. No, the first two parts are clearly about traps. Then there's a weird ice platforming. Because, you know, gotta pad it out a little bit. <laughs> now that he's defeated the first five Kooplings, Mario realizes his journey is about to get a whole lot more difficult. He proceeds due, uh, he proceeds due to an uneasy yet not unfamiliar feeling of being held at gunpoint. Beautiful storytelling here. That's not inaccurate. <laughs> oh man, world sex. So this is kind of funny. The cup translation translates the next world as sewer side city, as in, you know, on the side of the sewers. Like the sewer, sewer level, but on the side of it, and there's a city. But the Leomon translation puts this down as Suicide City, as in the act of removing one's life. Both might be appropriate, I guess we'll find out next time.